This video will consist of animals with injuries. If that is something you don't want to see, please turn back. Out of all the monkeys that were injured between mid-December 2022 and mid-January 2023, these two are the most puzzling. In summary, there's a video of Yat. A veo, trying to clean one of Jimmy's wounds. Jimmy gave him a hard time. Joyce seemed to want to help Jimmy get away from Yat and she nipped at Yat. I believe Joyce or Joy for short was one of the monkey pets abandoned with Jimmy or was once living with Jimmy as a pet at one time. This may be why she was so protective. Was she punished for trying to save Jimmy? Jimmy got loose before Yat could finish spraying stuff on him. Yat seemed frustrated with both Joyce and Jimmy. He tried to coax Jimmy back with food and the rest will be easier to explain while we watch. ไอ้ครับเดี๋ยวดิเจ้าเฮ้ยครับทําไม่ลําซาได้อยู่ลืมมาตาปรอยตัวอาจจะมีนี่ใส่ทมขึ้นมาที่นี่บัวเต็มเ
Not going to lie, I get so angry seeing Vanna wanting to just take care of Nori by trying to sit with her, and Kunthea refuses to let her. These monkeys are no longer pets. They shouldn't be handled by humans anymore. You'll notice Vanna tries to groom in between the biting and pulling. Monkeys, mothers in particular, will nip at babies to get them to comply. As an adolescent females like to play mommy. Which it seems to me, Vanna is upset that she no longer gets to hold Nori. Babies have very specific cries for help. Nori appears to be giving those calls. But poor Nori is stuck in a tug o' war between Kunthea and Vanna. Notice how Kunthea isn't holding Nori close at this time. I honestly believe she is enjoying this for her content by putting Nori at arm's reach from Vanna. Soon Nori will have an accident. Monkeys will often have sudden bowel movements when under immediate stress. Poor Nori is all I can say. Hey, what are you doing? What do you want? When mothers, as Vanna is playing mommy now, will often have to groom in order to get their kidnapped babies back from the alpha. This is why I believe Kunthea took Nori away from Vanna. She tries to groom Kunthea to coax her to give over Nori. I'll be doing a video on monkey behavior later. I feel bad for both Vanna and Nori. I think Vanna is getting more desperate now that grooming didn't work. You can tell by the way Vanna is trying to grab Nori that she isn't trying to attack her. She's trying to get Nori to let go so she can grab her. But it is Kunthea that has the grips of Nori. The way she is crouching as she's trying to grab Nori is almost the same position she would be in if she had Nori and was able to sit with her. Why not let her go and try to get a hold of Nori later? But no. Kunthea is willing to risk Nori getting hurt more, just for her own selfish reasons. Just to show you an example of exactly how evil this woman is. Here is her doing this yet again but with a different pair. You will see Kunthea's face light up enjoying what is going on and the end results are a swollen ear on the younger monkey. That's great content for her. Make it seem like the big monkey is evil, but yet, she's the evil one. Here is another video of, Yat, but this time cleaning Nori's wounds. He usually is the one to attend their wounds, but it seems ever since Joyce was injured, he's not done it. Other VOs have been attending to wounds within the troop. 
which makes the whole Joyce thing a little more suspicious, but I digress. Vanna tries to come to Nori's aid again. Yat is being really rough with Nori. She's giving calls for help. It's really heartbreaking. She's literally being tortured by these VOs, in my opinion, that only care about themselves and not what they're doing to the animal. He drags out this whole procedure to 10 grueling minutes. I've cut it down to 6. <laughs> Soon you will see that his hand is practically around her neck. Even sweet little Dawn is feeling bad for Nori.
Okay. Ini tahu ah lah deh. Ini mulat, nanti nanti. Nanti It's just a theory but if you look at these two pictures, you will notice the pic on the left shows that the injuries are at the same angle and nearly the same size. In my opinion this would be hard to replicate if it were teeth. The picture on the right, you will notice the imprint. Her skull is left with an odd wavy-like shape. My theory makes me believe that Nori was injured by a stick. The nosebleed nori had can be caused by head trauma from an impact with a blunt object. Blunt objects can tear away skin at least from my understanding. What do you think it was caused from? Let me know in the comments.